It is not surprising that athletes make a lot of money, this is something we all know. Yet, when it comes to determining which athletes make the most money, that order may throw some for a loop. With that in mind, here is a look at the top 10 highest paid athletes in the world in 2016. Number 10. Kobe Bryant. In case you slept on it, 2016 marked the close of Kobe Bryant's NBA career, and while the Lakers may have seen something of an ignoble finish, Kobe's bank account was hardly worse for the wear. The Lakers icon banked a cool $25 million to close out the season, making him the highest paid player in the league over last year, at least in terms of the size of his deal. The rest of it comes from endorsements, Kobe's been signed to Nike ever since his bailing on his deal with Adidas, after Bryant reportedly disliked the Kobe too, and it's safe to say that his other deals, with companies like Coca-Cola, did not left him hurting for cash. Number 9. Jordan Spieth. Jordan Spieth's meteoric rise has not only made him one of the biggest names in pro golf, it has almost made him one of the richest athletes on the planet. Consider, despite a disappointing finish at the 2016 Masters where Spieth, the defending champion, choked about as hard as you could imagine on the last day of the tournament, he is still one of two professional golfers to make this list. He earned $32 million in endorsement money. Thanks Under Armour. And took home $20.8 million in prize money. As long as golf's golden boy continues to add major championships to his name, the $52.8 million he banked in the last year will be chump change compared to his future earnings. Number 8. Phil Mickelson. Despite nearly adding his name to the list of golf's worst scandals, Phil Mickelson still had himself quite the banner year, financially speaking of course. Thanks to his partnerships with companies like Barclays, Callaway, KPMG, and ExxonMobil, Mickelson added $50 million in endorsement money to his already overflowing bank account. With a figure like that, it makes earning just $2.9 million in prize money over the last year worth it. Number 7. Cam Newton. Cam Newton may be the most magnetic personality in the NFL today, whether you are attracted or repelled by him. There is no denying that you are pulled one way or the other, and with that sort of star quality comes big money. The best player in Super Bowl 50, Newton's athletic ability has earned him a $100 million from the league, and as one of the most marketable players in the league, he can more or less take the pick of the litter when it comes to endorsements. Number 6. Novak Djokovic. After Novak Djokovic claimed victory over Andy Murray in the 2016 French Open, he became the first player to hold all four major titles since Rod Laver not bad for a guy that has somewhat lagged in popularity behind his immediate contemporaries. In fact, while Djokovic now has something that, say, Roger Federer does not, he is still only pulling in $34 million in endorsements. If he can challenge for the sport's first Grand Slam in nearly 50 years, that will almost certainly change. Number 5. Kevin Durant. In the last year, Kevin Durant took home $20.2 million in salary and bonuses, earned another $36 million in endorsement deals, and found himself at number 5 on the list of the world's highest paid athletes with $56.2 million in total earnings. Hopefully this impressive haul will take some of the sting out of OKC inability to finish off the dubs in the Western Conference Finals. Although, we highly doubt it. Number 4. Roger Federer. Roger Federer may not be the same tennis player who competes for Grand Slams on a regular basis, but that has not stopped him from holding serve as the sport's top earning player. Thanks to his sponsorship deals with companies like Rolex, Nike, and Mercedes-Benz, Federer managed to take home an insane $60 million in endorsement money over the last 12 months. When you combine that with the $7.8 million he earned in prize money, you are looking at a whopping $67.8 million in total earnings for the 17th time Grand Slam champion. It is safe to say that even when King Roger is not winning, he is winning. Number 3. LeBron James. 
Although LeBron James is on the brink of another finals loss, he can take solace in knowing that his bank account is far from suffering the same sort of defeat, and likely never will. Aside from making $23.2 million in salary money, LBJ reaffirmed his unrivaled marketability courtesy of $54 million from endorsements. On top of that, thanks to the unprecedented lifetime deal he signed with Nike, the $77.2 million in total earnings that James made over the past year is going to look like peanuts compared to his future earnings. As always, it is good to be the king. Number 2. Lionel Messi Not only has Lionel Messi's creativity and magic on the pitch made him one of the top two soccer players in the world, it has always made him one of the top two highest-earning athletes on the planet. And that is a fact. Despite making $28 million from endorsements over the past year, the majority of Messi's $81.4 million in total earnings came from his salary and bonuses $53.4 million to be exact. It's no wonder they call soccer the beautiful game. And the highest paid athlete in the world is Cristiano Ronaldo. Like Real Madrid after winning the Champions League, Cristiano Ronaldo is on top of the world of highest paid athletes. Thanks to his sponsorship deals with brands such Nike, Daguerre, and Herbalife, as well as his own line of products. Ronaldo brought home $32 million in endorsement money over the last 12 months. Of course, this figure pales in comparison to the $56 million he earned in salary and bonuses. Either way, the dollar signs have spoken, and with $88 million in total earnings, Ronaldo secured his place as the highest earning athlete in 2016. And folks that's our video, also check out our other videos. And please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to VidMoon for more informative videos. Thanks.